Welcome to Bambridge Medical Art. This video, I'm going to teach you how to use tennis unit to treat for tennis, tennis elbow. Well, how it works. Well, when you have a tennis elbow, that means there's tendon acid right in here, the tendon is inflamed. When they inflamed, the circulation became poor. All the elastic acid, and uric acid, and the carbon dioxide, and all the other mineral are beat up here. They create inflammation, create pain. So what you need to do, you need to promote the blood circulation flow through here. The Asian Chinese series, let's say qi is blocked. When the qi is blocked, it causes pain. So what you need to do, you need to promote the qi flow through the area. Once it flows through the area, the pain will be gone. So if you tense unit right in here, can create a motion like put another heart here to make circulation better. Okay. That gives uh, blood more power right there, automatically. So what you need to do is, you need to find, before you put the tense unit, you need to find a, a trigger point, or you can call it an ash point, the most painful spot. Usually you move it, or if you press it on it, you can feel it. Usually on top, of right in here, that where uh, the pain is. That be not hard to find. Sometimes you have a uh, tendon elbow can uh, elbow can the pain can read it down. This uh, extensor muscles along here. Sometimes it can be another spot. Can be very painful too. So if you do it. You put a one pad on this trigger point right in here. You make sure the root of this uh, this line must be lined on the, the ash point, the most painful spot. That's very important. You make sure that spot is is jumping, moving. So another one you can put the uh, put on the, this extension muscle. You find out some another painful spot, or if you don't have any other pain along this muscle, you can just find any, any place along this extensor muscle. Okay, stick right one right in here. So it doesn't matter this one. The most important is this one. Have to be on top of the trigger point. When you turn this machine on, you have to feel the jump, like a pulsing. You can feel that most painful spot have to move it. That is very important. Okay. So you don't need to put it all the way on it. You could just, just touch the most painful spot. Because the spot is so small, that's why the pad a little bit up a little bit, you can see. You when you turn on Now you can see the muscle is jumping. You can see, I can feel the shock right here, like a little, like heartbeat. Okay. So enough to make the you can see the muscle moving. That'd be good enough. But you have to feel on this spot. If you don't feel on this most painful spot, the jumping, moving, the pulsing. You need to readjust the area. Very important have you land on this most painful spot. You can leave it on for one hour, or you can use it as many as you need it. Whatever you feel ache and pain, you can just put on this spot. Sometimes you can leave it on for hours. But I recommend recommend people just at least like one hour a day, like that. And the, Normally, you should feel some relief right away. Okay. You don't have much side effect or risk either. So if you have any other question, you can go on bambridgemedicalart.com.